It's me, Cute Beauty 3. And Barbie0913. And I have a brand new doll here to show you. It's been out for a while, but it's brand new to us. Um, so this is from Ali Ella. It's like a, an Australian brand. Mm -hmm. uh, and they are all into like imaginative, functional play. Mm -hmm. um, and they, there was a Facebook ad for this, this little guy, the Dinkum doll that they sell, which is one of the brands that they've put together. Um, and I saw it and I was like, oh, that looks like a My Child. So I researched and I was like, oh, it's not a My Child. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so I thought I would pick one up for Lena for her birthday, which is coming up soon, mm -hmm. um, which is crazy. But I thought I'd pick one up for Lena. And before it's gifted to her, while it's nice and clean, mm -hmm. we would go ahead and do a review for it, just in case you are looking for one of these or you saw it on Facebook and were curious. So it's kind of like a Montessori, how Montessori dolls kind are? Kind of, like. yeah. Okay. It's very much like like UK sort of as well. Mm -hmm. Like they have some really cool functional pieces that go with this guy, like a high chair. Um, that's really cool. They have like trolleys and things. Mm -hmm. So many really nice things. But this is a doll in its glory here. It comes in this, this box here. As you can see, he is held in with just a simply a couple strings. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna cut him out. I believe this one was Sprout. They mm -hmm. have different skin tones um, and hair colors. A Dinkum doll sits here waiting to find a child who is loving, caring, and kind. Just one special child. Could it be you? It will be Lena. Mm -hmm. Let me get his other side here. Um, so I cut literally two strings and he pops right out. I do love that. There's no waste. Very little waste. And mm -hmm. you could always use this. There's instructions on how to make it into like a high chair on their website. Oh. Um, but you need more pieces. You can't just use the box. Get a doll. Give an education, a portion of each baby dinkum purchase goes to children's education. And I can't read the rest of it because I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> also, 1% goes to save the children um, as of 2020. Yeah. So 1% of the purchases go to that, which is really cool. Um, Cuddle them, dress them, style their hair, change their diaper or leave them bare, pull up their socks, Stand them tall in their shoes. Whoever they'll be, it's for you to choose. You see, each dinkum is different, like each of us are. Each dinkum is special, the most special by far. Each one wears a rainbow right over their heart. Which and each one is searching for their kid's counterpart. Oh, uh, so this is Sprout. <laughs> Cute. It's so cute. It is cute. Um, as I said, it's unisex. It's, you can style this hair in pigtails. You could make it a mess of it like it is right now. So you can make it a boy or a girl. It's soft bodied. Um, you can style the hair. There's a rainbow on the heart, much like a Cabbage Patch Kid would have a, a mark. Um, this one has a rainbow on the heart area. Uh, it's made of cotton. And these nurture empathy and imagination, and they're poseable in the fact that you can move their arms and legs up and down. And if they're wearing their shoes, they can stand. That's <laughs> cute, cute shoes. Right? Those are cute. So before <laughs> we dive into him, I just wanted to take out my My Child. This is why I was like, oh, they look like My Child, because it's a very similar construction. <laughs> Without the um, glass, the plastic piece for the eye. Right? Yeah. But size-wise, they're practically yeah. the same. This is a little smaller, um, and these guys are a little, like, taller and maybe thicker, but they are very similar. So if you know someone who aesthetically has really liked the My Child look, mm -hmm. this is something you should get, whether they're young or old. Cute. So we're going to put my My Child over here um, and talk a little bit about Sprout. So this is kind of what they come in. They come with their shoes and this basic sort of outfit. And this is what Lena looks like, so we have to... Pick it up. <laughs> yeah, Lena's hair Lena's is like always Ooh. all over the place. Um, and they do sell outfits separately. So I just picked up a, the Dinkum PJs in Ginger, and that's just a cute little like hat. Hat and booties. Hat and booties. So if Lena wants to take him outside or her outside, 
Uh, she already Cute. has some booties for her doll. Cute. So this is red. They're red. It's like ginger. We can open them. So we have the little dinkum hat here. Oh, it's the orange ginger. I gotcha. It's a carrot. They have like more um, like fun outfits, but I figured I'd get her started with some pajamas to change her doll into. Um, and then if she feels, if she changes outfits a lot, then I, there's a whole new wardrobe I can give her. Mm -hmm. But it'll be so cute! Cute. And then I have also, I put her little hat on. This is like a Ron Weasley look. Yeah, kind of, yeah. Mom made the, the sweater. <laughs> um, so I'll take the little the hat off here. Um, and then there's these booties here that do have a hard flat bottom. So mm -hmm. I don't know if she'll if the doll will stand in them, but they are super cute still. Oh, yeah, they got a sole. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Cute. And then I'm going to go ahead and see if we can see. So I thought maybe this was buttons, this is Velcro. Mm hmm So let's un-Velcro this. See if we can show the little heart. Oh, to see there's a rainbow, rainbow uh, right above the Sprout's heart. Green, yellow, and orange. Aw, super cute. Understated, but also very, very cute. So let's put that on there. And you can move Sprout's head, too. His head moves, so you can do that. So cute! cute. I love how simple these are. I love that there is, like, no gimmick other than it's just, you know, a doll that you can, you know, put life into. And I love also all the cute little fashions that they have. There are other sorts of dolls that they sell, so now I'm, like, waiting for the next yearly or semi-annual sale. I think they do a sale once a year, mm -hmm. which is how I got these guys because they were cheaper. And I was like, I'm going to test them out when they're cheap because they're not the cheapest things in the world. No. Um, the clothing does go for any 14-inch doll. They love to share their clothes. But this is definitely a brand worth looking into. They're just so sweet and, like, they're so huggable. I'm hoping Lena likes it uh, and that she gets into it because I want to buy all the accessories. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I want to buy, like, all of the things. I really want to buy the high chair. <laughs> mm, so cute. Right? I thought aesthetically you would I'm like him. Tight. I like the forever ones. I also like the Montessori type ones mm -hmm. that are really cute. This doll has super cute stitched eyes, um, which you see here. And he has like a little stitched smile and they're all unique uh, and made with quality in mind. It's just so cute. She hasn't figured out that kids don't always like what their moms like. I don't care. I it's a doll. It's huggable. It's a doll. Yeah, I know. That's why I didn't I go know. crazy with the outfits. Yeah. I think he also has underwear on. So if you yeah, do it's, take... it's a diaper, I think. Like yeah, well, we can just un... Oh, no, maybe it's not a diaper. It's just underwear. You're right. Let's see. So, if we shimmy this down a little bit... Shimmy, shimmy, Coco. He does have... I'm going to call it underwear. Just a little... Yeah. Aww. That's just a tag. She'll love the tag. Mm-hmm. <laughs> She likes tags. Yeah. And, you know, if she doesn't like him, I'm sure he can find a home in either of our collections. No, no, he has to stay in her I think collection. Lena will, will enjoy just, you know, hugging him every now and then. She likes the hug. She likes to give big tights. So that is a Dimkim doll from Aliella, um, a company, like That's I said. That's a mouthful. Out of Australia and also a mouthful. Um, <laughs> there are other dolls. Definitely check out their website. This is one of those where... I was like, I have to show it on the channel, and I'm so glad I have a reason to buy it. <laughs> <laughs> um, but this is just one of a few. It's so cute, guys. It is cute. You should look at them. It is cute. Next time they have a sale, definitely don't hesitate. The quality is there. It's 100% worth the price. And they make the cutest fashion, so if you are looking for something for 14 inches, this is mm -hmm. also a brand to look for, too. Isn't that hat so cute? <laughs> He's like a little elf. Right? <laughs> and I thought like the raspberry would go well with the skin. Yeah. Cute. So that is um, just a little bit about Dinkum dolls. Don't you can... tell Lena. It's a secret. <laughs> um, so you can find the link in the description area. Uh, definitely check it out. Let me know what your favorite is. And we'll talk to you soon.
拜拜。Bye.